What is up guys, it's your boy Kiss. I'm with a brand new video here on Harry Potter. We're gonna go quick through this, okay? First what we do is we go on that clock and we actually go back in time. And we're gonna unlock this character token by shooting the case. Then where there's a box in the back, we're gonna shoot that and actually jump inside of that so we get a gold brick and that's all of collectibles here that we are gonna get for now. So then we continue on here in this new area where there's nothing so we go back and check if we've got, got everything here. I see that the bed can, make, can be made red but there's nothing that we can get from here so we actually do end up leaving anyway and there's nothing here that you can really do. There's this kid jumping on the on the seats but really once again he doesn't really get anything for us so it doesn't really matter if we're shooting him or not. So then we go uh, out of this room and that makes us go back to the normal time so actually what we're going to do now is going to follow that ghost because we're gonna have finally the lesson that we're looking for is the one where we're gonna learn how to break metal so we're going to be happy dancing there jumping around and trying to keep track of that ghost following him pretty quickly um, yeah, so we just can go there and actually get some collectibles there as well because guys I will I will say this right now There's a little bit of a few collectibles that we will be collecting from that one So be sure to be prepared for that one here He shows the lesson a little bit on how or what he's going to teach us first of all And of course we have to see Ron try that as well But of course Ron puts everyone in danger and yeah, there we go. They well think that we have to save him now so we're gonna save the people right now but we're gonna also go pretty quick through this we're gonna find these few metal things in the middle there was one and then there are some others that we will be finding later on there's a silver one there in the back and then you have the spider webs actually there's a second of the third there is also this metal one but underneath that blue cage we will also break that when you kill that blue man there's also a metal one um, when doing this bookcase one, you're also getting a metal um, object that you can shoot. And then with Harry, you can also light that, um, light this thing and then also shoot that. The last spider web is over there. We can actually get the Parvati, um, well, collectible really. And then you have to break that wall for the last, and la uh, last metal thing that you can get a gold brick for. There we go. We get that as well. And now all we have to do is save that last little kid over there and then when doing that we also have this lanterns that we can light over here so we're gonna do that real quick and we are gonna get another character token for that one if you couldn't keep up with that i know it went pretty fast but all timestamps are down in the description so just check them out and you'll be able to get all the collectibles very quickly and easy so there we go we're trying to save this little last kid but once we are done with that we can actually go and end this level we got the reducto spell so we're now basically having every single spell so we can actually go and continue doing everything else so that's going to be all the collectibles over here so we're going to the next area here where we have done here if, if you're in this area make sure that you do all the lanterns here because we're going to do the last one for this um, lantern series over down here we can actually now break down this uh, metal on the lantern here we also will do these three little um, well, yeah, I would say panels on the wall, we shoot those and now we can do with the metal one, we can also get the last one and here we also get the last one of the lanterns because we can also finally do that one with the metal one. You should have done them all if you followed along with all my videos. And that's all the um, stuff we get from here. Then there's one more character token that we will be getting in our free roam over here. That's going to be Cedric uh, the, from the League task, which is going to be from the rockets that we've done one um, of one. Uh, we don't one of them before as well but now we're gonna do the second one this green one over here i'm shooting it it flies away and then you can just grab the, the pumpkin and go and fly towards it grab it and there you go we get all the character tokens and all the stuff that we were gonna get from the free play all right so now we're getting in this scene where we see that there are all these golden eggs and it's still of course the turn of harry potter to go and try this out himself so now we're going we're getting in this mission here right here where we have to fight this dragon as we said as we saw before with Hagrid showing us a little preview on what's going to happen here. So here nothing nothing really happens yet until uh, Hermione actually starts using that bucket to put water on that fire to make it go away and once you do that actually there's this character token that will be revealing himself that you can grab and it's going to be Cedric who is the, doing the dragon task 
very easy and very quick. Now you see me trying to basically hide myself by using this, well, that thing, that bucket over my head really, big bucket, but still, it doesn't really work because, yeah, they can just jump and make us, uh, well, get it off of, off our head, so that was not really necessary. And we made this little puppy who's gonna try to fight that dr dragon, but obviously it's gonna break and the dragon wins this because a dragon wins from a fucking dog. That's normal, right? And there we go, we're just gonna continue on with going uh, to, the ne to the next part of this level. And here we're gonna have to make this strength potion later on. If you see that in the back over there, there's this handle that we're gonna have to pull, but we don't have those those strength characters with us, so we're gonna have, need to find something that is strong enough. Here we see already that here's the flower, we just need to use that light for the plants to go away. And there is this platform that's gonna um, move us up to that, to that little... Um, uh, lever actually to be able to pull that but we need to get up there so that's gonna be helping us with some air and there we go we're actually trying to create this pot right now that we can actually put the ingredients in and get that strength for that lever actually so now we did also that little um, dancey dance with the skeleton so we actually got the skeleton bone that we can put in the potion as well and there we go we also get the teeth of the snake over there and now I'm going as Harry already to that lever, but I actually jump next to it instead of on top of it. But Hermione is actually drinking already the potion. I'm drinking it as well because you'll see why that's gonna, why it's gonna be of a good cause here. But you see Hermione jumping on that stone once again and actually jumping over to the lever, but failing as well because we're both just stupid idiots who can jump on a fucking floor it's pretty easy but how do we fail this i don't have no clue anyway i jump again and almost fail that again i don't know how the fuck i'm doing that but anyway i pull that lever and it actually makes this well this stone actually also go up and now we can get up there and we can continue on with the level by putting that stone on that purple block but for some reason hermione is trying to put that on the stone over there which makes no fucking sense so yeah <laughs> that's pretty nice so we're going back to the uh, putting it back on the other block but i'm doing it even worse i just throw it off the fucking map because i'm even worse than hermione so i finally do end up putting that block um, that stone on the block and we can actually finally continue now this dragon comes here and spits fire on those stones so we have to wait before we continue but that's really not that bad we just gotta jump on top of it on top of it after the fire has been removed there we go and there's one last jump we have to make over here that we're gonna do as well there you go and i tried to make it actually well, I don't actually, I just wait for the fire to be um, gone and then I jump over to the last part of this little section over here. Once again, someone throws something at us, but that's for dark magic, so we can't really be doing that. So we don't have to worry about that yet. Here you can actually get a character token if you do it correctly. Put the green, the blue and the red um, blocks beautifully on the purple block and you will be getting a, I think it is a Slytherin house crest piece but we don't do that here but we'll do that in the free play because we didn't really realize it in a free play i do put it perfectly so there so there in that one we are capable of getting that here as you can see already i'm just putting it as, as fast as possible down so we just get to be able to go up there no matter where the blocks are uh, placed i don't really care about it i just want to be able to get to the top when we finally do get to the top actually i actually do fail jumping on that block because of the green one just disappearing but Hermione gets on the top and that's where we get this little cutscene where the dragon is attacking us and actually this professor I have no clue what his name is is, is going to help us by throwing us or actually telling us to get grab our uh, broomstick and we fly away there's this little scene where we can see us flying away from the dragon but basically what happens is that we basically uh, fall off our broomstick i think it is i think we fall off or no we get hit off yeah that's right we hit off but we fall and we get landed perfectly on this building of course because we're lucky as fuck we don't die we are just harry potter so what happens here is we have to run away because the dragon is going to follow us and it's going to be literally running behind us so we are just gonna run 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 but pay attention because there are some collectibles that we're going to be collecting from this area here the first building you go in you straight up go to the right side there will be a character token it will be Fleur from the dragon task right over here to the right you get that one there you go and then you can continue on 
to the second room where there will be nothing but in the third room we also have to be paying attention because there we will have to grab a raven claw piece and there will also be a um, closet where the student will be stuck in so we can actually shoot that and actually frame him now with this reducto that we've learned so we're going to run again because obviously we started running too far so the dragon is following us again so we're just gonna run 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 nothing happens here so don't worry about it just grabbing some coins we are looking for some stuff thinking if we might miss something because this is a very annoying level if you don't know where to look but we were pretty lucky on looking where where we wanted to get our stuff so here there's nothing so don't worry about it just nothing to worry just keep on running and you will be getting that stuff in the third room as well plus we will be showing everything in the free room in the free play sorry so don't worry about it too much so now I'm dying here because I'm too slow actually the dragon is keeping up with me and then we're gonna try to go and continue on to the third room as I said I actually die of once again but we see that Hermione can grab the Ravenclaw piece as I told you guys that it would, would be and right here on the on the right side there's also this closet as you can see here that we shoot open and there will be the student that was stuck there as well but obviously we make sure that he has to make sure that he's going to run as well because well there's a dragon behind us so that's gonna be it for the collectibles over here so now we're just gonna run away we're gonna keep running and we're actually gonna get the true wizard status in just a second here over here because we're gonna be getting around 30 000, uh, 60 thousand studs so that makes us be able to get the true wizard there you go we got it and that means that we will also be getting a gold brick for that here we turn to the side so the dragon can't keep up with that and actually falls off so we fly with the broomstick once again away from here grabbing well actually first putting down Hermione and then he goes and grabs the gold brick uh, the gold egg himself and we get the reward for collecting it and then he's whispering something to Cedric but that doesn't really matter to us because I don't really remember what he said anyway Anyway, that's gonna be it for me. Thank you all for thank you all for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe, turn on post notifications because I'm going to be posting a lot more videos just like this. And yeah, I hope to see you in the next one. Peace out.